Well, this is 460 South Broadway. As you guys can see, lots of police officers by that door, one with a, a gun pointing upwards. And let me show you the area. Again, 460 South Broadway. More officers there at that corner. Two doors down. But the concentration is right here. Now, I'm going to tell you how the call came in as. I cannot tell you that it's exactly what's going on for sure. The call came in as men barricaded inside, possibly with a handgun, armed shotgun, handgun, some type of a weapon. That's how the call came in, not necessarily what is going on. Let me show you, the officer is there. The officer is there with the shotgun pointing upwards. A la gente que habla español preguntando qué es que está pasando. La gente que, que habla español preguntando lo que está pasando. Mire, el reporte es que hay un hombre posiblemente armado dentro de ese apartamento en 460 de South Broadway. No, I'm okay back here. So, allegedly armed, we cannot confirm. I'm just giving you the news as I hear. Okay, but there is always room for error when you broadcast live as the story is developing. Yeah, thanks, bro. You got to say innocent to proven guilty. And allegedly, there's a person. That is right. You heard, you heard the person who's next to me making a very valid, making a very valid point, allegedly, and it's innocent until proven guilty. Just because sometimes somebody's in handcuffs does not mean that the person is guilty of any crime. So make it clear for our audience. So guys, this is just on South Broadway and Radford. South Broadway and Radford. Uh, o pessoal que fala português perguntando o que é que está a passar. Estou aqui na 460 de South Broadway. Supostamente há um homem armado dentro desse apartamento. Nada, nada, nada é confirmado neste momento. As you guys saw the lights on the hallway, on the hallway, when, well, I don't know if it's the lights of the hallway or is the lights from the, from the flashlight from the, from the police department.
Guys, I am across the street. Let me show you the street. And this is the sidewalk where I am, completely across the street. Once again, for the guys that are just logging in and wondering what's going on, I'm here at 460, 460 South Broadway. Four sixty South Broadway. Allegedly, there is a man armed with a weapon inside that apartment on four sixty South Broadway. I cannot confirm if there is in fact a weapon involved. I'm just giving you the information based on the information that I have. Remember. When you live stream or broadcast live, there is always room for error. Again, guys, there is always room for error when you live stream live. And again, this is alleged. It's not confirmed. What did they say? I can hear. I can see. Innocence to proven guilty, see? That's right. No, that's we it. said that, right? Yes, yes, yes. And again, let me make it clear. Just because somebody's handcuffed does not mean that the person is guilty of any crime. Everyone is presumed innocent until proven guilty. Okay, so let me make it clear. And I'm not here to judge anyone. I'm not here to say if somebody is innocent or is guilty. That is... That is not my job. I'm just here to film what's going on so the people of Yonkers, of the community, knows what's happening in the city that you live in. The beautiful city of Yonkers, New York. <laughs> hey, I agree with you. you I, I, I've been living in Yonkers for 40 years. I love my city. Me too. Okay? And, and guys, let, let, let me make it clear that things happen everywhere. I told you, tell them to give you a shield. I'll hold your camera. No, oh, no, no. I'm, I'm good. I'm good. <laughs> Somebody's telling me, ask for a shield and go in there. I'm okay. Oh, look at, look at the... Remote control out here. Now, I don't know if you guys can see the robot. The robot right there getting ready to possibly go up. That should go climb the stairs? Yeah. <laughs> that shit got camera on it. Oh, this shit look like Call of Duty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that shit got heat sensors, got cameras. This shit look like Call of Duty out here. I like to see that shit go this thing. Oh, it goes up. <laughs> you guys seen the robot right there on the ground by the door? Ready to go up. That's what allegedly. Allegedly, okay? Allegedly. Yeah, allegedly. Allegedly. Well, they heard you. <laughs> That's what he said. He said, "Why don't you get in the camera?" No.
Come on, you sure you want me to hold your camera? Nah, I'm okay, man. I'm not going nowhere. All right, all right. What if we go in the smoke shop? Do they allow it? Where is the smoke right shop? Right here. No, they don't let you go. Oh, I get a lot of did you see the other story I covered on, uh, I think it was the Maurice or earlier? Nah, I don't got fucking social media, so oh. I haven't seen that shit. So I'm covering the story, then 19 shots, you know, fired. Today? No, a few months, a year ago, I think. Oh, One of the shots hit the tree where I was hiding. Get the fuck out of here, bro. Thank God you're okay, man. <laughs> 19 shots? Yeah, and then the guy shot himself. Oh, yeah, we broadcasted it. So you guys saw the police officers going up? Traffic is very slow because everyone sees uh, lots of police officers around and they slow down to see what is going on. Well, Peggy, there is a man possibly armed inside. I think the police have uh, more important things right now to think about besides traffic. They know exactly what they need to do. They know exactly their job. So uh, let's not criticize them from behind uh, a computer or a keyboard. They know what to do, believe me. So again, guys, this is 460 South Broadway. The report came in as an, a man possibly armed inside the apartment. I hear that uh, this information was given by the mother of the kid, of the man, who said that she believes that the son is armed with a weapon purchased in Florida. Now, again, remember, I'm live streaming these and not all information is correct. And there is room for error when you live stream a developing story, an active story. So I'm giving you the information that I have, not necessarily 100% correct. No one has given me the information from the police department side. So I'm just give, relating the information that I'm having from third parties. And you know how it goes. Sometimes the information that third party gives you is not 100% correct or uh, verified.
I am not sure at this time if they have contacted the person that uh, they are looking for, if they made any contact with the person, if there is any communication going on, trying to get him to come out peacefully. How, how many views you got over there? Right now, live 353. Shit, you got it. You, you up there, my nigga. I'm telling you, that's why I said go over there with your camera. No, no, no. Shit. This shit taking too long. Something gotta happen already. So, as I was saying, I'm not sure if the police made contact with the person inside. Hopefully they and did. Just came out the and hopefully, <laughs> and hopefully, they will peacefully end this. I'm surprised they didn't tell us to move out of here yet, you know? Yeah, because they know this is, they, can't, well, this too, they don't know what's going on. Yeah. It's all right, man. God forbid we get hit with a stray or something, you know, make sure you record it and we'll sue. What? What? Weed is legal, bro. Let me get some bud. From my favorite bud man. I was like, hold up, nigga. From my favorite bud man. Nah, we can smoke right in front of him, nigga. Weed is legal. It's legal. It's legal. That's it, Papa. That's it, Papa. Don't be scared, Bobby. Roll that shit up right here, man. Don't be scared. I waited 20 years to smoke weed in front of these niggas. <laughs> So what you got, a real scanner or you use your phone? No, scanners don't work no more. No? No, they went, they went scrambled in digital. So police scramble, you know, police radios don't. Yeah, they scramble the signal. Yeah, they scramble the signal. So what you use, your phone? People call me, you know, people at the scene, you know, they text me right away, you know. All right, so before that, before you got your name out there, what'd you do? Before we used to have a scanner. Oh, was that recent? But the last three years, they don't have scanners. I mean, they, they scramble. Now we're gonna be in competition, all right? Cause I'm gonna make a YouTube channel, and I'm gonna be the neighborhood hero. And whichever one of us make it there first. Well, I put it to you this way: that is, this is big enough for all of us to uh, exist. Sure, that's what I like to hear. We could be partners. That's it, man. What's your name again? Huh? Hero. That's, it. that's a good name for a for a channel. Yes, that's what I'm trying to tell you. We can work together. As long as you always say innocent to proven guilty. I always say it, man. And I always tell people, don't judge into conclusions. You can't judge a book by its cover. Yeah. Not, because there's 15,000 cops, they don't mean it. Not everything guilty. is what it seems to be. That's hey, it. innocent, man. What the fuck you talk about? They probably got him mistaken. The they the probably seen his shit. keys and they thought it was a gun. Whatever it is. I think it's bullshit. It's possible. It's possible. So as you guys see, this takes time. It's this is not a movie. This is real life. You know, it it's real life. And the officers hopefully will talk to the person inside and bring him out because I can tell you. Look, I've been doing this for long enough, and I have noticed that not everything is what it seems to be. Damn. We don't know if the guy is armed. We don't know if he's not. So the police takes all the precautions necessary as if the person is on. That if it turns out that it's not, then best, then good, you know? Now, what surprises me is that uh, there is lots of people right behind where I'm standing. And uh, the apartment where the, the alleged armed person is, is right across from where I'm standing and everybody's standing. Normally, police removes everyone from a direct line of fire in case there is a shot fired. So normally they remove all the civilians. I'm surprised 
that uh, they have not done that as of yet. Maybe they will now that I said this. Look at my old car, man. Uh, look at my shit, my nigga. Look, 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 look at Pat driving by. Look at my shit, man. Oh, that's a mechanic. Hey, Pat. That's a mechanic. That's my old car. I'm not sure if uh, the officers made an entry yet. Okay. Uh, we know that they went up with the shield and, uh, and the robot, but uh, we are not sure if they made entry at uh, this time. Again, this is 460 South Broadway reports of a man possibly possibly armed inside they are hunting for the rats and roaches they are hunting for the rats and roaches near police hunting for the rats and roaches well that's it he, he said what he needed to say i'm here come on let me go inside i'm that's going it. to get him back just go run in there yeah. just run go ahead we don't ask permission, just run in there. <laughs> Come on, man. Right, you had the fun, you had the fun, uh, talking and laughing, and uh, what are you doing? Beans are invincible. Brock, you so know, what maybe you he does doing? have a chance. Maybe he's on to something. That's it, Papa, run up there. Yeah. I'm wondering if they made an entry yet. What are you doing? Brock, you all the way. What are you doing? That nigga probably got me. Come on, go! Run inside and get the back. I know how to do this. I know how to do this. This is not real bomb. 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 They know what's going on outside. Yeah. Got the bird's eye view. Yeah. Uh, there was a case from Belmont that the person inside was actually watching what I was broadcasting. Yeah, I so then they came to me and asked me to, to go offline. Because it's possible. Well, listen, if you ever see me getting pulled yeah, over or something, you. don't record me, man, please. <laughs> That's all I, I have. Respectfully. So just be safe and don't get involved in no shit, man. We don't want you or anybody else to... And if it does something happen, you say, this kid is innocent. I know him. So look, so I'm glad you understand the value of the camera. Because if you are, then you have a video that shows that you are, right? Yeah, yeah. Now, you talk, nothing is there. Okay. This guy needs to be in the video. Yo, man, go over there. Go fucking run in there and that's it. Hey, hey, yeah, hey, I, hey, I, hey, I, hey. I'm, go I'm going. They're oh, going shit. Nothing is there. Go ahead, they got him. They got him. Go kick the door. Yeah, that's what I'm telling you. Nothing is going to be there. Ah oh, man, y'all niggas didn't oh, come out with nobody. He got away. Yeah, maybe that is. Yo, they need you. Well, guys, you saw the police officers coming down, but they did not come out with anyone. So maybe there was no one inside after all. I don't give a fuck. Rich, with you. The officers are leaving the are leaving the area now. Maybe this was an unfounded call. Maybe this was an unfounded call. But remember, when a call comes in, 
of a possible armed person. The police needs to investigate. And if it turns out that uh, it was nothing, well, better off. It's better not to be nothing than to be something. And uh, officers or civilians, you know, getting hurt. So thank you guys for watching. Until next time, this was an ending that it looks like no one. Sorry, sorry, go ahead, tell them. No, you want to be on camera? No, I don't want to be on camera. So it looks like Yonkers police could not solve the issue. So well, we have another innocent man free to sleep at home tonight. So no one was found. Maybe this was an unfounded call. Maybe uh, it was bullshit. Well, you heard it. Maybe it was bullshit. Who knows? But the police has to respond just in case if it's not bullshit. And we're here to, we're here to, to keep the people, I mean, enlightened of the situation. Exactly. We're here with the great Yonkers voice. We're here to report. We're not here to pass judgment. We're not here to tell anyone is innocent or guilty. We're just here to report and let you know what's going on on the streets of Yonkers. Until later, guys. Stay well, stay warm, stay healthy.